All right, there you are. I'm Shane Wilson. I am the meteorist director for Halcon, which is a uh, sci-fi fantasy comic book convention in Halifax. Cool. And so, how's it? How how has Halcon been this year? It has been truly incredibly amazing. Last year we had we sort of rebooted Halcon. Um, there's a bit of a history to the name of Halcon, but we rebooted it with an entirely new board of directors, entirely new uh, volunteers, and uh, we had we were expecting about 800 people. So really, we're a group of geeks and nerds who are looking for people to pay so we could be geeks and nerds to come and help us bring people in. Uh, we were expecting 800 people. We had 1,400 people. This year, we were expecting about 1,800 to 2,000 people. I think we've gone well beyond that. I don't have any numbers because the weekend's not finished yet. So, but it's just been amazing. I, I did hear uh, from a friend of mine that it sounds like... You guys sold out your day tickets yesterday? We did. We sold our day tickets. We also, because we're a not-for-profit, I can tell you this, we broke even on Friday about 2 o'clock. We broke even. For the, so everything that happened, every fan who walked through the doors of this convention paid for a uh, better one next year. So it's, it's really exciting. So I, um, I also heard there was almost... I could be wrong with this, but I overheard someone saying there almost wasn't a Halcon this year. No, no, not at all. The Halcon uh, 2011 was being planned as we were executing 2010. So, nope, that's just a rumor. We, just a rumor. Uh, we in fact, I think uh, Jennifer, who's uh, one of our uh, chairs of our board, uh, she had actually booked guests for this year before last year's con and paid, paid for them. So, no, that's just a rumor. I actually heard that on the floor today. But it's not true. Okay, cool. Yeah, got it off. All right. Um, so, what, what's the, what are the uh, any plans for next year yet? Or is uh, it nothing we can talk about yet. Uh, but we've got some stuff in the works. We've all, we're already starting our uh, sort of our post mortem on this year, so we make it better next year. We do that every year. Uh, we've got a few guests in the pipeline, but we're not really talking about them yet. We've also we're really lucky this year. I think it's going to be very exciting for next year. Is uh, Aaron Gray was here. And Aaron Gray not only is sort of uh, a, a geek star from uh, Buck Rogers, she also runs Heroes for Hire, which is the foremost genre booking agent in North America. She absolutely positively loves us. So she has all the big names. So she's going to go back to California. She's going to tell them that we're a great place to be. We have friendly fans and our checks don't bounce, which, let's face it, it is a business. Yep. Um, and, and to her... That's what she needs to convince other people to come, maybe at a bit of a discount, because we're a great client. So, I don't know what's going to happen next year. It's uh, We've got a few things in the works, but look for it. Cool. Fantastic. Thank you very much. All right. Great. Thank you. Thank you.